This is John Boyer, the Dean of your college. I'm surrounded today by the warm familiarity of books, books that have spurred so many thought provoking discussions, insights and relationships with students over my years as Dean and as Professor of History. Books are essential to the kind of community that we have here in the college and to the experiences that we miss most acutely when we are isolated from campus. It is comforting in challenging times to remember how our books join our experiences and I'm looking enthusiastically to the chance to resume these sorts of conversations with you. It is difficult to assimilate the fundamental changes that we've all experienced in our personal and civic lives over this past month and that continue to await us. A few weeks ago, we were together as a community of many friends, seeing and encountering each other in person on the quadrangles in Regenstein and Harper in the houses and in Logan, you perhaps on foot and me certainly on my bike. Now we remain a community of many friends, but we are dispersed throughout the nation and the world. We are not estranged, but we are apart, and this hurts, and it hurts a great deal. Learning that we, we will do together in the next nine weeks will take different formats than in past quarters, and inevitably it will require flexibility and patience and even a bit of cunning. I've always admired the seemingly curio endless curiosity and resilience and creativity of our students. While these coming weeks will test those virtues, I have the utmost confidence in you. Over the next weeks, you will interact virtually with your instructors, and I hope that you will find there are indeed positive opportunities and experiences within our new remote learning environment. But it would also be good for you to continue to do things together beyond your coursework via online conventicles. Communities are resilient creatures, and so are the many friendships and relationships that make our community so strong. I hope that you will stay in touch with your friends, hold virtual meetings of your RSOs and your houses, Check in on the academic interests and on the personal welfare of your colleagues and friends. If you have a great idea, share it as a common good. Throw an online dinner for some of your friends and please raise a toast to the Maroons. It's also vitally important that you remain confident about your futures. The college is prepared to devote massive resources in the months and years to come to helping you progress in your professional and personal aspirations. This has always been an extremely high priority for me as Dean and I promise you that we will do all that we can to help you move forward successfully. We see your future as the future of the rest of us. Our commitment to helping you achieve your fullest potential is truly profound. Protecting our community, protecting all of you as citizens of that community and protecting the college as a brilliant experiment in learning is our shared challenge, our common task, and together we will not fail. I wish you a safe and intellectually stimulating quarter and I wish you and your family's health and security in these very difficult times. Thank you very much, and I will be back in touch very soon.